Hi, Rob Doerr, Vice President of the C-Series Program. I'm here in Mirabel to give you an update on the program. Um, behind me you see uh, the second CS300, actually the last flight test vehicle, and it's uh, with the flight test team and uh, ready to support the flight test program. Aujourd'hui est une journée historique pour Bombardier. Je suis heureux de confirmer que Transport Canada a délivré un certificat de type pour les aéronefs C-Series. A major milestone for the program happened in December was, of course, the uh, certification of the uh, CS100. Uh, we had the great pleasure to have our Minister of uh, Transport, uh, Marc Garneau, to hand us the uh, type certificate. Every seat row has one and a half window belts. Great milestone, of course, uh, very um, exciting after a lot of hard work. So I want to thank all of our employees and all the suppliers and stakeholders that help us to get to this major uh, important milestone. So now that that's done, we're focusing really on uh, the, of course, the production ramp up and also the entry in the service. On the production side, uh, very exciting. It's great to now see the factory is full of aircraft and we're ramping up um, and getting ready for deliveries to our customers. A couple of weeks ago, we had Swiss Airlines here and we presented them their very first aircraft so they had a chance to walk around and inspect and take a look at it. I have to tell you, they're very excited and uh, they left with uh, big smiles on their faces. So, uh, kind of really nice to see and, uh, and experience. Oh, yeah, Perfect. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Second major milestone and event that is really special and very personal. Uh, we had the um, pilots from Swiss. There were 12 pilots that were here doing their uh, training program. And um, of course, they went through the classroom training and they went through the simulator but they all had the opportunity to fly for the very first time a brand new aircraft which is very rare in someone's career. It's so great. It's absolute beauty to fly. It's probably one of the most excited days in my flying career. We have uh, slim, easy, very good uh, standard operating procedures. The way how you fly, it's not anymore that you have to work so hard because the airplane, airplane takes a lot of automation and it's just doing it. It's smooth, it's quiet in the cabin, uh, there's a lot of space and lots of light. Well, when I came in the first time I saw the big window and I was just impressed. Said, well, it is bright here inside. It flies nice, it looks nice. I'm looking forward for the next flight. Quick update on the CS300. Um, the uh, program now in terms of certification is over 70% complete. Uh, flight test program progressing very well. The second uh, aircraft uh, just entered into the flight test program and will be dedicated to uh, basically the interiors and cabin uh, certification testing. And the first aircraft is really completing now the performance testing. And the most uh, recent tests were actually regarding the brake test. So all uh, progressing very well and uh, really solid results. In preparation for the entry in the service, we've been conducting basically route proving flights uh, with the CS100. We call them uh, functionality and reliability tests. Uh, we've now done over 300 hours, uh, we've done over 70 uh, city pairs and very impressive results. Uh, so far we've had 100% uh, uh, dispatch, meaning no interruptions in all those flights. Uh, again, very encouraging uh, indicator for the entry into service and especially for a brand new aircraft. So uh, again, uh, really solid results on that side. 
We also now have time, so we're taking the aircraft to uh, air show. So we're actually here at Singapore Air Show, and you're going to have the opportunity to uh, visit the aircraft, uh, take a look around the outside, go inside the cabin, uh, check it out, and also have a chance to sit in the cockpit and see uh, what the C-Series has to offer. So I hope you enjoy your visits. We'll also be doing some demo tours while we're in the region. Uh, so stay tuned. Thank you very much.